for clicking on my channel, Joy's Way. If you're new here, welcome. And if you're a returning supporter, welcome back, awesome person. Today, the Collaptastic ladies are back at it again. Unfortunately, this is my second time recording this video. I'm so irritated. But anyways, if you're not sure of who the Collaptastic ladies are, it is Lori Latimer, Lauren Perkins, Becky's Empty Nest, and Jamie Javaris, I think. Um, she just recently joined, and myself, obviously. So the five of us get together every three, four weeks, whenever we have a chance, and we do makeup looks. And today, we're using the... Um, the Flash Color Palette by um, Oakland Natural Color. And Becky's Empty Nest actually sent all of the Clabtastic ladies this palette and then um, these other makeup items. These two are lipsticks and the this is mascara and an eyeliner. So... I already recorded my video. I was so excited to play with it um, when I did my friend mail and winners um, video, if you watched that. But I recorded it, and then when I edited it, it like would not ex what is it called export for I couldn't do nothing. Like I went in, I re-edited it three different times, and each time it would not export. So I Googled and Google said that it was probably a fucking corrupt video for whatever reason. And that's why it wouldn't export. So here we are the second time around. <laughs> but anyways, um, I do know because I already played with it once that I am going to need a eye primer. So let me get those on my eyes. All right, so I went ahead and put my Morphe eye primer on, and look, Stephanie, I haven't lost it or broke it yet. And I'm also testing out these Mighty Patches for your blemishes. I have one right there. Um, the reviews on them are awesome. I can't remember where I got it from, but we're going to see if it works. So try to remember to like all that, too. <laughs> if my damn memory lets me remember that is so i did decide i am going to do both looks and um these are the shades there are no shade names so i'm just gonna tell you the color and i'm gonna go ahead and since i already did um the blue eyes first i'm just gonna start with the orange eye so i'm gonna take the whole orange color and I'm going to put that right here in the creasy crease. Okay. It's really annoying that I have to um, record this video, but it is what it is. I know it happens to all of us content creators at least once or twice. I just have bad luck, so <laughs> more than it probably should. Ah, that's pretty. I do like this formula. Um, I think so far, all the colors that I've used, it goes on great. It blends great. Um, honestly just don't think it's that buildable because I didn't think it was that buildable in the last video either but it does have a decent color payoff so maybe you don't need it to be that good of a uh, buildable product and there is a lot of fallout so some people don't like that, but it don't bother me because I do my um, eyes last, or my eyes first. I do my eyes last, man. I do my eyes first, um, so that way I can clean up any fallout or anything like that. But I know some people just don't like it at all. And in the first video. 
um, I also said that I believe that this is a palette that would be best for a beginner, like, because there is color, it is a decent um, color payoff, but it's not very buildable, but it does, like, go on your eye nicely, and so it blends and um, very well. And there's no patchiness that I've seen, not since this is my second time playing with this. And, uh, anyhow, oh, I just stuck that in my eye. Like, don't do that. Yeah. So I don't think they're patchy. I don't think that, uh, you know, there's, I don't know, I just think it would be really good for somebody that is starting out. So quickly, I used the, um, the orange first, then this like orange pink, and then the pink, and mm, you can't really tell. I don't think you can really tell between the orange pink and the pink, maybe a slight little bit, but I do want to go in with this um, right here, this color here, and we're going to put that. I'm just going to use my finger and do that, and then I'm just going to put it on here. I do like their shiny payoff too. Oh, I think it is nice. Alrighty. So there's that one. And it's already taking way longer than I wanted. So let me clean this off really quick. So I'm going to use um, this color, this color, and this color in that order. All right, so I got my brush cleaned off, and this was the um, color, or this was the colors that I chose the first time I recorded it. So my very, very first impressions was these colors here, and I thought, but I did do both my eyes the same color, and I thought that um, I thought it turned out fucking amazing. And honestly, like I couldn't believe how well it turned out because this is like, um, like you know. Uh, I guess it'd be kind of like a drugstore brand or something, or dollar store brand. I don't know how that works, drugstore. But, you know, a cheaper brand anyways. Um, so, it actually impressed me a lot. Everything impressed me but the eyeliner. We'll get to that when I put it on my eyes. So... Okay, trying to go as fast as possible so that way this video, oh, I forgot how pigmented that was. It will. Okay. okay, okay, and then I'm going to take that one here, right there. I'm going to do the same thing. So I did try out, um, I did like a whole wear test and everything. I'm not going to do that with this video. Um, most likely I'm going to take it all off and redo it again, redo a different look. Um, but anyhow, so, um, I did do a, a wear test for like eight or nine hours and it was nice actually. It, um, the, without using a eye primer, it actually, the color stayed on all day long. And if I can get that clip in, then maybe I will. I don't know if, because I did that in a separate, you know, take. So maybe that part won't be considered a corrupted video. If I can, I'll put it in. If not, maybe I can at least take a picture and insert somewhere because I was so impressed. Like I was so impressed with this palette. So, cause I didn't think it was going to be that good to tell you the truth. Like, because when I swatched it, it was really pigmented. Um, but you guys don't even get to see that either because that was in the corrupt fucking video. But anyways, um, so everything was pigmented, but it wasn't as pigmented when I put it on my eyes. So when I first started doing the video, I was thinking to myself, this isn't going to turn out good, but it turned out great. So because this is taking a really, really long time, I'm just going to go throw mascara and eyeliner on really quick and then be back to finish up my thoughts. 
All right, so I wanted to jump back on real quick and show you what just happened to my mascara. So, which is a shame because I really like this mascara. I just dropped it, like, um, I picked it up, it fell out my damn hands, it hit the floor. It's like, what, three fucking feet from, yeah, about three foot from the floor. And it broke like that. So, be careful, ladies, with your mascara. This one, I'm talking to the other Collaptastic girls, or if anybody's bought a brand from this. Um, so I'm just going to throw it away. I'm not even going to do my eyelashes. I'm just going to use my... Uh, <laughs> I'm just going to use this right quick and put a little bit of my clear mascara on just, you know, do the hell of it. I do this anyways because, let me tell you, I got this at a do for a dollar at the dollar store. And they only had one. Or maybe it was Walmart. I can't remember. But I wished they had more because I would have got more. Anyways, I put this on because this is not waterproof. And then... I let it dry and then I add my eye primer after I add my eye primer let that dry and then I put on all my mascaras right so when I take it off at night it comes off so easy it's so easy it's so easy anyhow I think it's because of that clear mascara but I use that mascara from eyebrows and for my um, mascara or my eyes my, my eyelashes but anyways, um, I'm going to go ahead and use this bullet lipstick because it, I like it. I like bullet lipsticks better than a liquid lipstick, especially because neither one of them matte. And this one, <laughs> you guys are probably like, what the damn lipstick on? Um, but this one, uh, it's like really like moisturizing. So I like it. All right, and because it doesn't dry down like a normal matte does, um, it doesn't last that long. It does transfer, like if you drink your coffee or a cup or whatever. But while it's on your lips, <laughs> it feels so good. So that's a plus in my book. Now, I did use the eyeliner. I'm going to tell you, though, this is not a beginner-friendly eyeliner. And I'm going to tell you why. <laughs> Because there is no give in this eyeliner whatsoever, like none. I do like that it has that point right there. Can you guys see it? Can you see that point? Well, anyways, because not all liquid eyeliners have that fine of a point, so I like that. But the rest of it, it's pain in the butt to put on because you have to do it a little bit at a time. It's not like you can just put it on and glide it all the way through. I like, like for instance... Um, I have this uh, LA Colors liquid eyeliner, and you can just do that with that. I have this um, waterproof she matte. This, I believe, I got at the dollar store during, um, mm, I forget, forget, Halloween last year. And this, you can just slide right on. Um, or no, this is the one that I got for Halloween last year, so maybe this is the one that I got off. I don't know where I got it from. But anyways, you know, and I have this one that I, you know, I have, I have a lot of them. So, I mean, I'm not a makeup expert, but um, I know a little bit about liquid eyeliners because those are one of my favorites. And this liquid eyeliner is not beginner friendly. I do, these two lipsticks were the same color, so it really doesn't matter which one you choose to wear. So anyways, don't forget to check out the other ladies in the Collabtastic group if you're into these type of collabs, and if you're already not connected to them, if you feel like maybe, you know, you mesh well with them, then go ahead, subscribe to them, give them some loving. If not, I completely understand, because not everybody is everybody's cup of tea. Anyhow... I do appreciate all the time that y'all give me. I love you. I hope you have a wonderful day. Remain awesome and peace out. Awesome crew.